What's up? It's your boy Jason. I'm playing around with my uh, my new phone, iPhone 8 Plus. It's not new. Well, it's new to me. <laughs> I know it's like iPhone 11, yada yada yada. But uh, anyway, I can only afford iPhone 8. So anyway, come to find out, uh, they have a bunch of apps on here that I can use for my uh, you know my music stuff. So um, I know last video I showed you guys that you. I had reason with the Ableton uh, project. So I come to find out the reason actually made an app for the iPhone called Reason Compact. I'm ready to pull it up here in a minute. And basically, I can lay down beat ideas on this app and then able to link it to Ableton, which is pretty cool. I'll probably show you guys that later. But anyway, I'm going to show you these features here. Just a quick review, real quick. I think it's, it's pretty useful. Normally, you know, I mean, they're either in the bathroom, in the office, or just walking around somewhere, and the melodies just pop out of my head out of nowhere. And normally, I try to either record it on my phone via video or audio. So this is this is pretty cool. So let's go up here to the right hand corner here. We'll go through here. These are the you know few settings that they have. You got the tempo there. You got the scale there. I mean, shoot. A major, if you go to major or minor, something real simple. Um, you kind of scroll through and they'll go through each each scale, whatnot. Um, done. Let's go back here. Got the note grid, either chromatic or scale. Uh, you can make purchases. This is the Ableton link here I was telling you about. Got an Ableton link here. Make sure you turn it on. Uh, gives you in-app notifications, sync, start, stop. It's pretty cool. I, I just have to, um, I'll show you guys that in another video. Um, we got here setting for background audio. And the cool thing about this is you can also export this, uh, audio file. You can either export it to Reason, if you have Reason. Um, oops, let me go back. This project, my fault, y'all. Yeah, either export, you can go to Reason, uh, export as a sound file or a preset. So that's pretty cool. Now let's uh, let see what this thing does. Oh, this is the name of different projects you can go to. Normally I just go to New Project and shoot. Let's go on to these instruments here now. You got a choice of three different instruments, drums, lead, bass. Even start a beat out. So. I'm gonna go to drums. It's got all these different features on here: distortion, delay, re reverb, fade out, pitch, filter. You got all these instruments here. You can change the kits at the bottom here. Um, let's just I'm just gonna pick one. Hip hop. And you got all these features up here. You got record, play. Um, I don't know what this one is. Oh, this is where you can buy different uh, packs for each uh, set of instruments there. Record, play. You got a sequence in here. Look, look at that. It's already divided up to kick, kick, snare, hi-hat, cymbal, tom, clap. I mean, it's ridiculous. Um, you got your, it takes you back to this uh, these effects here, and you can trash it. Trash can at the top. So. I'm going to go ahead and let's see if we can lay something down here. Got the metronome on. Tempo, I'll just keep it as is. Loop length, I'm going to say four bars. And let's see if we can lay something down. So hit record. Play when ready. Here we go. Hey. There we go. with that. Alright. 
All right, something, something simple I threw down. Hit done. Yeah, it's the to play. If you want to uh, change it up a little bit, you can go back to this grid up here. And it's got the sequence basically up to four bars. So, all right, let's go back. Go to leads. Be like... like that all you can do is trash it go back up here do the thing back to four bars and I'm gonna record again there we go turn the reverb a little bit I'm done with that. Go back. Go back to the base. I mean, y'all, y'all can just lay this stuff down, take it back to the house, put it in your session, and keep it moving. This, this is uh, so cool to use. Stop it. Go back up. Wish there was a way to freeze this all. Let's see, I don't know. So let's go record it. I don't like how that went either. Trash. Record. See how that go. Anyway, that's it. Basically with this uh this app. I encourage y'all to check it out, play with it. Um again in another video. Maybe the next one I'll show you guys how to link it to Ableton. We got a bunch of other apps in there you can link to Ableton, which is pretty cool. Um, but this is a good way of laying down melodies in your head onto the phone so you can save it and uh, get back to it when you get back in the studio. But uh, anyway, that's all I got. Y'all have a blessed day. Remember your gift to make room for you. Bring you before a great man. I'm out. Make me music.